Hello, IG Garage family. Is your car making a knocking noise, running rough, or showing a P0328 knock sensor 1 circuit high input, bank 1 error? This code can lead to serious engine performance issues if ignored. But don't worry. In this video we'll cover what the P0328 code means, where the knock sensor is located, very important, and how to diagnose and fix it. And at the end, I'll suggest two related videos, P0333, knock sensor 2 circuit high input, and P0237, turbo boost sensor circuit low, to help you understand connected issues. Let's get started. The P0328 trouble code means that the knock sensor, KS, in bank 1, is sending a voltage signal higher than expected to the engine control module, ECM. The knock sensor's job is to detect vibrations caused by detonation or pre-ignition, also known as engine knocking. If the sensor is faulty or the circuit is malfunctioning, the ECM cannot properly adjust ignition timing, leading to performance issues. Symptoms of P0328 Check engine light, CL, is on, engine knocking or pinging sounds, poor acceleration or power loss, reduced fuel efficiency, and engine hesitation or misfires. Common causes of P0328 A faulty knock sensor. The sensor may have failed, sending incorrect signals, wiring or connector issues, damaged, corroded or shorted wires leading to the knock sensor a loose or improperly installed sensor. If the sensor is not properly tightened, it may not detect vibrations correctly. Excessive engine carbon buildup. Deposits on pistons and valves can cause abnormal combustion triggering the sensor, and ECM issues, though rare. A failing engine control module could misinterpret sensor signals. Where is the knock sensor located? Knock sensor, KS, Bank 1 usually mounted on the engine block cylinder head or intake manifold. Look for a small sensor with a single electrical connector plugged into it. In V6 and V8 engines, bank 1 refers to the side of the engine with cylinder 1. In inline 4-cylinder engines, the sensor is typically located near the middle of the engine block. Wiring harness and connector. Follow the wiring from the knock sensor to check for any damage or loose connections. Underneath the intake manifold, some models. On some engines, the knock sensor is hidden under the intake manifold, requiring removal of intake components for access. Check the wiring and connectors. Inspect for frayed, corroded or disconnected wires. Clean and reconnect if necessary. Test the knock sensor. Use a multimeter to check sensor resistance. Refer to vehicle specs. If readings are outside the range, replace the sensor. Tighten or replace the knock sensor. If the sensor is loose, tighten it to the correct torque. If it's bad, install a new sensor, clear the code, and test drive the car. Check for excessive carbon buildup. If your engine knocks even with a working sensor, clean the intake valves and combustion chambers using fuel additives or a professional cleaning method. So that's everything you need to know about P0328. Knock sensor 1. Circuit high input. Bank 1. If your car has knocking sounds or sluggish performance, start by checking the knock sensor, wiring, and carbon buildup. Before you go, don't forget to check out these related videos. P0333, knock sensor 2, circuit high input, and P0237, turbo boost, sensor circuit low. Hit that like, subscribe, and bell icon so you never miss a fix from IG Garage. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.